Hey guys, so my first ever video that I posted on this particular page got flagged and taken down for violent content, which nothing about this is violent. This is my job. I do this every day, all day. This is what I do in a hospital lab. And this is the specimens that I look at. And this is for educational purposes. So with that out of the way, we're going to try again. So this is one of the specimens that I got in the lab that day. So as you can see, it started to separate. Um, there was just so much in there. Um, it was just a really full urine, let me say that. This is what it looked like under the microscope. There's a lot going on. There's red blood cells, white blood cells, there's bacteria. You can see all of it in here. So right here, this and this, these are triple phosphate crystals. Triple phosphate crystals are typically found in alkaline urine, which means it has uh, urines with a pH greater than seven. And in this case, the urine had a pH of 8.5, so definitely alkaline. This is a better picture of what triple phosphate crystals in urine look like. Now there's two different categories of crystals in urine, abnormal crystals, and these up here are the normals. Triple phosphate crystals are found in highly alkaline urine and UTIs. They typically have no clinical significance, but they look kind of scary because they're coffin shaped. Also, all abnormal or pathological crystals will be found in acidic urine.